you know, over the last, ever since the beginning of this month, ever since the beginning of June and the release of The Acolyte, I've been seeing both sides of the Star Wars fandom, or at least two sides in particular of the Star Wars fandom, playing it out over this show. One side saying this is the worst piece of crap that Lucasfilm has ever released, and on the other side, you've got a group saying, if you don't absolutely love this show, if you do not think it's the greatest thing that Lucasfilm has ever released, if you do not think it's the greatest piece of Star Wars content ever done, you're a bigot, you're a homophobe, or whatever else. And you know, at this point, I'm content just to sit on the sidelines for the most part and enjoy my corner of this fandom, my corner of this universe. Enjoy what I consider to be Star Wars. Some of it's old, some of it's new. Let me give you a look. Lithographs from the remaster that I still own. A special edition lithograph from when the special editions were released. A poster of every single figure ever released, going all the way back to the 77 line. Many that I used to have. Some I unfortunately no longer do, and some that I have been fortunate enough to collect now. A sideshow exclusive. Darth Vader, Anakin, when he turned. I'll eventually do an unboxing for him, I think. Vintage toys. Some almost completely fully restored. Some still in need of some TLC. But you know what? Time far more well spent than fighting over a show, to be honest. And yes, all three of these from the 77 line. Three of which I never owned as a kid. And now, as an adult, I happily do. The old EU. Revan, Thrawn, Luke from Dark Empire, and yes, Boba from Book of Boba Fett. The Skywalker family line, minus Anakin, but I will eventually have him. All the way to Jaina Solo. The new EU, The Mandalorian, Bo-Katan, Cara Dune, Ahsoka Tano, Professor Hu Yang. Three of the greatest characters slash villains in the history of Star Wars, Vader, Fett, Journal Beers. One of my proudest, one of my favorite pieces of my collection, the entire original 12 figures from the original 77 line, including those scummy bounty hunters. And if I want to watch Star Wars, I've got it on VHS, I've got it on DVD, I've got it on Blu-ray and 4K, I've got every edition, both special, uh, non-specialized, and 4K. I've got soundtracks, I've got books, arc, hardbacks, paperbacks, graphic novels, just a little bit of everything. And then just Funko Pops, Vader, Palpatine, Luke, Obi-Wan, Maul, and yes, big man himself and his grandson and down here yes figures from the Mandalorian and the book of Boba Fett so you know while y'all are online fussing and fighting and fuming over the acolyte is it good is it bad is it the greatest thing ever is it complete and utter, tra uh, complete and utter trash I, I think uh, me and more of my fellow Star Wars fans are happy just to sit on the sidelines and share what we enjoy. 
just as I have here now and what I will continue to do in the future. And I think I speak at least for some of this fandom that I am a part of, and I say this very happily. This is the way. <laughs>